Hey there, Tightliners. This is Dan Schwartz with your weekly fishing report. As the early run sockeye salmon winds down on the northern Kenai Peninsula, late run king fishing will open Monday on the Kenai River. Brian Miller, co owner and manager of Trustworthy Hardware and Fishing, said the Kenai will likely be fishable then. But as it is currently muddy, he said anglers should use darker lures for fishing the late run kings when the river opens. If the water clears, brighter, flashier lures will be more effective. The late run king season, July 1st to the 31st, will open on the Kenai River from its mouth to the Alaska Department of Fish and Game markers, about 300 yards downstream of Slycock Creek's mouth. For anglers still seeking early run sockeye, Miller said the Kasilov River above the boat launch is fishing very well. The Russian River is slowing down and the Kenai River is nearly done for the early run sockeye. But soon, we'll start seeing the late run come in on the Kenai River. Rivers are certainly not the only option, however. Anglers have been successful in Cook Inlet and stocked waters on the Kenai Peninsula. <laughs> Miller said halibut fishing has been off the hook. This year, halibut have been smaller than past years, but anglers have been having a lot of luck with jigs or lighter tackle fishing for the fish. And recently, it took a sport fishing charter only three days to catch two halibut tagged in the Homer Jackpot Halibut Derby. Anglers fishing in the stock Sildovia Fishing Lagoon and Homer Nick Dudiak Fishing Lagoon have been catching fish too, said Carol Kirkleyevet. Assistant Homer Area Management Biologist for Fishing Game. Off Homer's spit, anglers have been catching pollock, cod, flatfish, dolly, and occasional kings. Miller said lakes and ponds are good options too for anglers. The ice in most large and small lakes and ponds is melting, and anglers have been having luck trolling. He suggested anglers bring leeches and spinners if they're planning to camp by the lake. Anglers should check the Clarion's Tightlines page for current fishing game regulations before heading out to fish.